Welcome back to episode 3 of BDS Roundhouse, and in today's episode, we are going to shift focus away from Jellybean. Why? Well, the content we are about to check out is miles worse than Jellybean's content will ever be. Feast your eyes for something worse, because we are anting on emoji marbles. So, what in the hell is an emoji marbles? Emoji Marbles is a very god-awful YouTuber who makes shitty one-off effect videos as well as shitty commentaries that have no actual valid criticisms whatsoever and stupid copyright claimable reaction clips. Jesus Christ. I could make better video edits than that. And for an example, here's an anim one as an example. Speaking of commentaries, today we will be reacting to one of the Emoji Marbles made that noob hater which is an amazing YouTuber, and for that reason, I'm gonna link it below. I bet at least 20 million dollars that Emoji Marbles is gonna whine and complain about this video in his community tab. Anyways, without any further ado, 3, 2, 1, hit it. I have many friends. He has better toys than I President, sir. It's a disaster. Justice Roberts is a disaster. Welcome to the channel where I find the worst channels in history and where- how about you say the worst channels in your opinion? How about you shut the fuck up and let him get to his point he was going to make on you? I'm gonna rant on emoji marbles. Why is that? Well, let's just look at his videos because all he does is screen record. That's it. Uh, actually, wrong answer. I use more than a screen recorder. I use a video editor. I use a text-to-speech voice videos. I use texts. The most ironic part about me making this video is the fact that I'm using a Daniel text-to-speech voice to express my points instead of using my real voice, which is way deeper than the text-to-speech voice will ever be. Again, your content consists of videos that have one effect added to them that even my dead pet goldfish could even do, as well as copyrighted reaction clips and commentaries that have not so great comebacks, and if there are any, very rarely. Hell, the gameplay footage that you are watching of Under Night in Birth EXE Late SG is entirely recorded off of the PlayStation Vita at a consistent 60 frames per second, something that your videos lack. Enough bragging aside, let's continue the commentary. We'll probably stick in one image. Well, actually, I sometimes use more than one image, not- Alright, I'll give you that one since you are technically right here. This guy claims he puts effort, yet all he does is screen record. Scream recording is putting effort, duh! You have got to be fucking kidding me. Did he just say that screen recording is literally fucking effort? I can reassure you that using a video editor is infinitely way more effort than screen recording something. Hell, the beginning clip of his channel I did in fact screen record, so call out my hypocrisy there, except the gamma play footage in which I recorded the screen of the Vita. Enough chit chat, let's continue before I have a brain aneurysm watching this shit. On freaking Google Images, he's too lazy to literally go on Giphy and find a GIF on this. Well, sometimes it's better to use an image. Because, because if you use a Giphy, it would kind of... I'm losing brain cells over the fact that he said that it's better to use an image than it is to use either a GIF or gameplay footage. And again, how in the hell does Emoji Marbles have over 6,000 subscribers? I can guarantee you that it is not because of a sub bot, because all he can do is literally post the same two or more images as reaction clips. By the way, I used to do the same exact thing when I made rants on Super Mario Logan and Lovell by using as real dreamer as my photos. I don't do that anymore because I later realized that using gameplay footage is infinitely better than using a PNG image of a character. Let us commence forth with the terrible commentary response video. The whole point of a screen recorder is that you could literally screen record videos and GIFs, no freaking images. Uh, actually, the whole point of a screen recorder can actually be to screen record anything, like a commentary, or images, or a GIF. I'm pretty fucking sure you can literally save photos, GIFs, and videos nowadays by either right-clicking save photo, or using a video downloader to get your video or gameplay footage. What I use a screen recorder for is for recording gameplay footage like the game you are seeing on screen right now, and for other purposes like Emoji Marbles channel as an example. I know for a fact that both of them did not mention that, but anyhow, let's keep going. If you're just gonna record only one image, it's better just to download the screenshot and post it in your editing software. Shut the fuck up, no one cares. 
know your fucking place, trash. And nothing of value was lost. Did he just use a filthy Frank clip to react to a very good criticism point that that noob hater made? I seriously thought the commentary could be better, but it actually got worse. If you are going to make a well thought out response to someone criticizing you, at least make good concrete solid points instead of using edgy reaction clips to actual criticism, because when you do, it shows that you are either dodging criticism, or you cannot handle any ounce of criticism. And I don't care he's a mobile editor, I'm a goddamn mobile editor, all my videos are made on mobile. This guy can't even do the basics of it. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Oh my god, stop fucking lying! Off to hang myself, hot and low! You realize that the vine you used is pretty much a dead meme, right? Second off, why would you accuse him of lying if he is directly telling the truth? If anything, it is solidifying that noob haters points made against you, that you literally take zero effort in making your videos and the fact that you cannot handle hate, despite the fact that you have a video fucking lying about handling hate. Just deal with the fucking criticism made against you like a better person, ignore the haters, and move on. In conclusion, the rest of the video is basically that noob hater making solid points against emoji marbles, and he only used a total of 4 single clips as reaction material, and those clips are 2 pictures of a BFDI muffin, the emotions being neutral and angry, a dead vine of why the fuck you lying, and the same filthy Frank Clipper used to hell, and back of him throwing the computer in the trash. In conclusion, learn how to save videos, photos, and gifs, plus record the commentary itself in the video editor itself, because the software has a microphone feature, instead of screen recording your commentaries by screen recording it. Since you are probably going to bitch and complain about this video by either making a shitty commentary or responding through your community tab, I give zero shits less about it. Anyways, thanks for watching the video, and if he responds to this video, I'm going to make a part 4 and house video by probably recording more PS Vita games or some PCO Mori gameplay. Anyways, I'm out. See you guys later.